I'm telling you, man, that uh, you said you said you're not gonna let your uh wife just tell you anything. Like you wouldn't just white night. You no, I gotta I gotta establish was. what the hell is why is it any different now that we married than it was when we first got together and your ability to be able to hold down a job. Now you now everybody hates you at your job and you and you got permission to quit. Listen. The grace comes, I think that women mm. are okay with quitting a job when y'all have the type of resources for them to be able to stay be a stay-at-home mother. If she if she is not a stay-at-home mother and she just working part-time, what is she doing with her other with the other So let's say she worked 4 hours a day. What's she doing with the other 24? Mm-hmm. You got to sleep 7 to 8. Cool. So that gives you 12. You got a whole another 12 hours. Where the rest of the 12 hours going? You talking about you asking me? Yeah, what the rest of her twelve hours? Okay, oh, yeah, well, right now for her twelve hours, she's been taking care of the house and she's been putting in more job application, more like full-time what? Job. Like what? What? What is, what is taking care of the house? Because it ain't no kids. So what is taking care of the house look like? Cleaning, cooking, make sure I got a meal when I come back home so I can eat. Driving these damn trucks all day. You are um, getting finessed, Shannon. No, I I'm swear to telling God, you, not. my friend. I'm telling you, you getting finesse, bro. Listen, it ain't and enough so cooking funny. and cleaning every single. If she cooked a meal every day and she recleaned the house every day, it's no way that that's covering twelve hours. But you're saying, but you're judging me by a a finesse thing right now because she working part time. That I told her to leave that job. You should not have it's told her to better. leave the job. If my wife got stressed and now that she damn near has a cyst on her damn uh lip, because I, I didn't want to give no medical details. Don't if give no medical details. Don't de- nah, don't get no medical details. Oh, okay. If the job was causing her to get stressed and I had to take her to the hospital and that was the cause of what's coming on, leave that damn job. No, nah, learn learn how time. learn how to de stress yourself and get the fuck back to work because we got a vision. Not when not not when okay, she's gonna get back to work full time. That's why I'm trying to tell you I'm not getting finessed over here, but the, so the men when, are gonna when run. you get home, you can look for a job, but in the meantime, I need you to go ahead and bring that bag home. The the men I don't think go you get try, that bag. I don't think you're trying to understand me. <laughs> I'm not getting mad, I'm just I don't think you're trying to understand. Okay, go ahead. How I I, I really want to know how I'm getting finessed. Because they, they always came with accusations. A man talking like this, he was born in a single pair house, so I already debunked that on TikTok. No, I wasn't. I didn't say you did. I, I know. I'm just saying, men in general, they're going to say that uh, I'm getting cheated on. I'm not getting cheated on. I'm never going to cheat. I know what the hell my bowels that I took. I don't believe bowels. you're getting cheated on. Okay, but you think that I'm getting finessed. I'm not Absolutely. even a six figure guy. I'm not even a six figure guy, but I'm getting finessed on a. Cause I'm trying to understand what it ta- what twelve hours of a day, uh, twelve hours a day. So you telling me she putting in job applications and she cleaning the house and she cooking for twelve hours a day? What else do? What else would you advise? I'm, I'm gonna listen to an older married with man with wisdom. What What is she supposed to be doing with the other twelve uh, hours besides trying to help me build my business? Working, working to help. forty to forty five hours a week. Now, now, if I just told you she has a part time job, now she's trying to get a, another job. How's she supposed to work? But she Full never. Sh- what she I'm saying, get- working, is that she uh-huh. never should have quit her other job in the first place. You talking about the flight attendant job? When either or, working- either or, huh? whichever one. Do you okay? Be honest. Do you honestly think that her being a flight attendant, and and me being over here on, on in the trucks, do you think that would have been sustainable? Yeah, people work all not, the time. I, were- every dude I know is literally traveling. Mm-hmm. The majority of the week, and they really don't even see their family until the weekend like that. Oh yeah, that's no, nah, that's no. Hold on, hey, hold on. This new age. I'm shit, not built for that one. This, the, the, yes, huh? you are. You built for it, Shannon. You are not dependent on a woman for your happiness, bro. A woman mm, is I'm extra. Not, I don't care if it's your wife. They're extra. They are not the thing that sustains you. They are not your purpose. She is not your purpose. Your purpose is your purpose. She feeds into your purpose. That's how you mm. become successful. That's how you're able to give her a vision. You don't have to lear- worry about sustaining a relationship. The, re- the relationship should be sustained based off of y'all actually living in your purpose. The sex is extra, right? The spending time is extra. You got the rest of your life to spend time with her. What the fuck are you trying to... Let me let me re- remove my language. What the no, hell no, are you, you trying good. to spend a bunch of time with her for? Go get your bag. Put that chick yeah, to work. I, I, 
I make more money locally now than I was over the road. But no, like, no, I'm no, just no. saying. You said with her being local, a flight attendant and you being a trucker. And me being on the truck, yeah. What's the do you problem? think do you think that will not do you think that will not open up the door to To what? Lust for lust because a lot of men cheat, for who? a lot of women cheat. You for you? That? Huh? For you? Yeah, for me. For me, for her. For you don't anybody. have no you don't, I thought you was you don't have dick discipline, Shannon? Man, I'm good. Like I'm just saying, dog. I'm just saying I'm too. Just saying. You telling me that secret? Dick, uh, okay, so Shannon, is uh, secretly are you a Pookie and a Ray Ray, Shannon? No, of course not. I promise. Then how come you can't control your dick? I'm not talking about me. You oh, said, said would well, it open I'm up the door for lust? If the door for lust is always going to be there. No, I it's not. You dick. can't tempt me with something that I'm not interested in. The door, the I'm saying the lust, no matter what, I get lusted on right now by women. I don't care. I'm fuck. not I, Listen, I'm not my DMs is I'm fucking lit right now. That don't mean nothing. I'm out in the streets every day. The one thing that you're never going to worry about for me is that it ain't uh -huh. not a woman in the world that I'm ever going to put mm -hmm. before my bag. And I feel that. I feel so that. So ain't I no woman ever going to get me off of my purpose because she not worth me fucking up my bag for. See, it okay, ain't even so about the go, woman. It's about me. Let's go back to what she originally said. If when she gets married, if she's in the air, or, or whenever she gets married, she doesn't want to do that anymore. No she wants to be home with her husband every day. And so if you I, saved if her. I married, so you uh, saved her. You saved her. You saved her. She gave you an alternative. You took her up on her offer and you saved her. That's what that it was. Is. That was already established way before. Wait, I met you her. saved her. That's what she already saved her. Yeah, she said that this is what I, she wanted to make, do. You, you understood the like assignment. Was, no, 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 no. You mm -hmm. understood the assignment, and you granted her wish. You saved her. You was her white knight. You, I, if, now, if I say I fell in love with this girl through a picture before I even had my first conversation with her. Wrong, took on wrong, day, All I knew. Wrong. I'm you tripping. should never fall in love with a picture. That is, that, bro, just because y'all don't have them type of experiences don't mean that a lot of us men don't. Like, I actually preach, or I actually, you know, walk what I preach. I, I, understand, I believe you. And that's why I'm giving so you a I, lot of credit. So, I Listen, so, I have to give you a lot yeah. of credit, right? Because you just being transparent, you being real, you being honest, which makes for a better conversation. But I'm telling mm -hmm. you that marriage is a business first. Before it is ever love, marriage, even historically, the way that it was established, the covenant before God, all of it is a business first. It is not based off of love. That is a new thing. The love comes with it. You right? think even, even you think God made it a business? It is absolutely a business. The only reason he even I'm talking about go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. I'm sorry. No, it no, go ahead. It is absolutely sorry, a business. Listen, and everything that you do as a man, seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, and everything else be added yes, unto you. Yes, sir. Me. Preach. The women come mm. with it, the money come with it. You being on your purpose, it all comes with it. You don't live for them. You don't live for something else. You live for what it is that you supposed to do. It's God over man, man over woman, woman over child, meaning that you shouldn't be doing things for mm -hmm. her. You should be doing things based off of what your purpose is. She feeds into that purpose and then she benefits as a result of it, of being in the gym with you. So if that be the case, how is she giving you alternatives as far as what it is that you supposed to do in order to make her happy in a marriage? Well, I'm explaining that it wasn't an alternative because she already had that in her mind. Right. Before we even got together. So I, I don't I don't understand. You well, fell in love with a picture myself, and then you saved her. You fin she finished. You. I through a picture. Yes. So you telling me? So if I tell you that I was on like looking through Facebook dating whatever, and God told me that that's my wife, would you believe me? <laughs>